Hi there, I'm Heather, and this is Discover Together at Halton Hills Public Library. Let's discover microscopes. In this video, we'll be learning about how to use the microscope safely. Visit our website at www.hhpl.on.ca to borrow one of the kits with your library card. Let's get started. Today, we're gonna to start with some safety tips when using the microscope. First, keep small children and animals away from any samples or experiments you might be working on. Next, when you're working with the samples, keep your hands away from your eyes and your mouth. You don't wanna accidentally swallow or rub something into your eye that could be harmful. And always remember to wash your hands very carefully when you're done handling the samples. The slides for this microscope are made of glass and they may break if they're not handled carefully. When moving the microscope around, you should always use two hands, one on the arm, which is this piece here, and one under the base or the bottom. And lastly, remember to return the microscope and slides back to the case when you're not using them. Next, let's look at how to set up the microscope. Place the microscope on a flat surface near a bright light or a window. Locate the mirror down here at the bottom and adjust the angle so you see a bright circle of light when you look in the eyepiece. We always wanna be careful when using the microscope. So remember, don't point the mirror towards the sun and then look into the eyepiece as it could damage your eye. If there's no bright light available or the room lighting is poor, you can flip the mirror over and it turns on this light bulb that we call the illuminator. You wanna point the illuminator upwards towards the eyepiece. Now, when you look through the eyepiece, you're gonna adjust the angle of the light bulb until you see a bright circle. When you see the bright circle of light in the eyepiece, you're ready to go. Thanks for watching. Are you ready to discover something new? Go to www.hhpl.on.ca and search Discover Together to put one on hold. And don't forget your library card. Bye.